in the world of dragons. Okay, rolling. Uh, uh, oh, uh, it's been peaceful here in the five worlds, or is it six? <laughs> For a dragon's age, we now have 12,000 treasure, or is it 14,000? What about this Ganasty Ganok character? Now, <laughs> I understand he's found a magic spell to turn gems into warriors for his cause. I'll take that question. Nasty Nork is a simple creature. Simple? He has been contained in a nasty world Nork. and is no threat to the Dragon Kingdom. No threat! Besides, he is ugly. Ugly? <laughs> that does it! Ah, uh, good job, Spyro. Alright, and with that, welcome everybody to the new Let's Play on the channel, The Adventure Begins. We're going to be playing Spyro. I need to turn down music so I don't get nothing dumb. Uh, I guess, oh, there we go. Yeah, no music. Uh, Sorry, I know the music's good and all, but I don't want to get any any risk that. But Spyro, I I've played Spyro, um, not as much as mo maybe most people, but I do know a few things about it, such as burning these guys to get those. Um, I know the dragonfly collects things for me. If I'm close enough, I know that too. I, uh. But uh, other than that, I really don't know much about it. I played through this back whenever it first came out, like the the, the remake first came out, and aside from playing it a little bit, I never really got far into it. Ah. Oh, that's not where I want to go. But uh, yeah, we're gonna be playing Spyro for this the next uh next let's play because why not? You know, Spyro is fun. There's a few things that can be annoying about it as far as I remember, but other than that, you know, it's entertaining, right? But I do know majority of the game is collecting the dragons back. You go to these statues and free everybody, and you get gems. That's pretty much what I know about this game. Hello. Thank you for releasing me, Spyro. Oh. Free ten dragons in the artisan world, then find the balloonist. He'll transport you to the next world. Okay. What about Nasty Nork? I'm going after him. Find dragons first. That's all I can tell you. Got it. Bye, friend. Ah. Is he still running? <laughs> he ran into me, actually. I didn't even go after him right there. Um, yeah, I'm gonna do what I can. I'm not gonna say I'm gonna get everything, because that'd be dumb, because I don't know much about this. I remember I, I, I have the Spyro on the GameCube. I do know that. But I didn't really play that much either, honestly. So, that's the balloon guy. I think this little thing's name is Flutter. I don't remember. I don't remember a lot of the lore about this game either. No. Ah. 
Ah, I got it. Skill point. Wait, there's skill points in this game? Um. Up. Uh. Yeah, these, these videos are going to be 15 minutes long. And if I'm doing something that requires me to search for something, I'll just show where it's at. Unless it's in like a complicated area, then I'll show how I got there. But I'm not going to sit there and make you guys watch me run around and collect things that are secret. Running through the entire world trying to find it. So. Argus. It's got a watermelon. Flash, do that again. The artisan's boss is through a portal in the dragon mouth. But you are not yet ready, Spyro. Oh. First, you must complete one of the other artisan lands. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh. Um. This way. I say I'm not going to collect everything, but knowing me, I'll still try to collect everything. Thomas. Hey, Spyro. Press the jump button twice to glide. And, Thank you. and don't be afraid. afraid. I'm afraid. Of what? Falling from high mountain peaks? Plummeting into prehistoric glaciers? Oh, that. Yeah. That. Um. Up again. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Thought I had to hold it. I guess you just press it and he glides. Okay. Apparently the chest doesn't count as landing on top of it. <laughs> Fine, I'll do it the way you're... <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> there, happy. Oh, there's a dragon over there and some more gems. I don't even know how I didn't see you. Deadlin. Delbin? Deadlin. Delbin. Where's nasty Nork? I'll torch him. Torch Keep your horns on, Spyro. You have much to learn first. Nuh uh. Do you know what the dragonfly following you is doing? No. Uh. His name is Sparks. Sparks. Where? Who's Flutter? Keep an eye on him and see what I mean. Why did I say flutter? Thank you, buddy. Uh, I think that's it. Dark uh, Polo. Alright. Well, let's, uh... What's over here? Nothing. <laughs> yeah, that's right, Sparks. You eat them. Um. You know what? Uh, we explored this area, I think, as thoroughly as possible for now. So, what we'll end up doing is I think what I'm gonna do is at least 
at least one ep like one world per episode. If not one world per two. I want to try to get each world done per episode, you know, so. Right now, we're done with this area, so we're going to end the episode here. This will be the end of the first episode. But next ep episode... I'm, I'm just making sure everything's clear. That I can right now. Okay. Yeah. First, ep or ne first episode. Next episode, we will go be going into... What is this place called? Stonehill. So I'll catch you guys in the next one. Hope you guys uh, are looking forward to this series. Uh, just know I'm going to be failing a lot because I'm not good with these controls. And I'm sure I'm not going to get adjusted very easily either. So yeah, I'll catch you guys later. Peace out.